What's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Mr. Vegeman, a.k.a. Tio Car Collector. Today is still Sunday, March 11, 2018. This is my second video. I'm going to show the mail and some recaps that I got. Also, did some in-person graphing. First, got went to George Tech again. Got a box of these um, baseballs. These practice baseball and foul balls. So, I'll probably do something with this at the end of the year and see how many balls I got and do something with that. But, just want to show you all that. And, I got two autographs here. I got Colin Hall. This is the manager's son. And, I got Trey Beckham. I had like eight cards to this dude, but he only signed one. But, you know, whatever. One's better than none. I got some other um, cards autographed too through the mail, but I'll show that later on. Um, let me also show some CDs and DVDs I got. This Beavis and Butthead um, soundtrack experience. They had like different CD, or different music. They had like some hip hop, some you know metal, you know different stuff on there from Beavis and Butthead. Also got one of the greatest rappers of all the time. I got Tupac All Eyes on Me. This was actually brand new. I thought it was a used one. I looked on eBay because I I used to have this, but didn't have any more. And like I got some Pac here. So I paid like more than I wanted, but it was a brand new CD, so it was all good. I also got some Marvin Gaye, so check that out. And as far as the DVDs, I got them Strangers, because this, this um, one that came out in 2008, I got another version of it that's coming out in the movies in a week or so, so looking forward to seeing that as well, but I love this movie. I actually, believe it or not, I went out on my birthday and saw this with my now ex-wife, and she took me to see this, so I love this movie, so definitely check it out if you haven't saw it. Also, some other classic movies. John Singleton has had Baby Boy, Higher Learning, Poet, Justice, Boys, and Hood. So, check this one out. Get this in the pawn shop. This looks pretty good. So, I said I'll get this for $2. Also, got this action movie here. Two bucks. Pawn shop. Not pawn shop. Goodwill. I'm sorry. But same difference. And I got this um, WWE 13. And this has some good wrestlers on it. So, I'm going to play around with this and see if I can download the wrestlers on here. Pay like three bucks for this. And also... Another one of these paid like two bucks for this. There are four films in it, like some horror movies. So definitely look forward to check this out. So that's that. Now as far as some of the other stuff I got in the mail. This is funny though. Um, Ryan um, that I graphed with, if you're looking at this, I know you're going to be mad at this. But we was actually, I was graphing um, at graphing the, what you call Phoenix Suns the other day. And we was just sitting there talking just about different stuff. And I was like, yeah, Santa Claus has some cards and... And he was like, oh, Santa Claus. He was just getting mad about that. But I was just like, you know, let me go get this Santa Claus auger. Because what I'm going to do, I'm going to take this and get with Mike O and probably get this slab. You know, and it's Mike O's um, PSA submission group. Not PSA DNA because it's already signed. So just get a slab. And I'll probably get this jersey card slab too. And the rest of the stuff probably just, you know, give it away for Christmas or do something with it. Sell a trade or whatever. Now back to... The game here and the stuff that I got signed here. I got Alex Lynn. I wasn't really organized for this, so I didn't get. I could have got more done, but I just had to get what I can get real quick. I got Alfred Payton signed one. Davion Reed signed two. I got on um, Jared Dudley in the Rackets card because I didn't even know he played for Phoenix. I got like eight thousand cards of him, but you know, I just got him on two Rackets cards. So he signs whatever you put out in front of him. I got oh, um, this guy Eddie Johnson. I got some of my favorites here. This is Mar let's see, Marcus Chris. He signed two. And I got the best one here. Or the two best ones here. Let me take this off here. I got one from Devin Booker and one from the rookie. This came out real nice. This is Josh Jackson. So I'm really happy and excited about getting these. Like I said, the game was a week ago, but I'm just now getting down, showing my stuff here. Also, I got some stuff. This, this is from eBay. This is Dick Duff. I won't send this in the PSA. I'm pretty much saw on the PC of him, so this look legit. And I got this one too. Since this one this has the Hall of Fame on here. And the cell also threw in some of these tall boy rookie cards. Not surprised with this. This is a brother playing hockey. I don't see too many brothers playing hockey. But um this is um Fred Brathwaite. Um I didn't don't really know too much about him, but I'll follow him, check him out here. I really don't like these tall boy cards per se, but, you know, hold on to these since they're rookies and it's a brother playing hockey. I'll see if he has any regular cards too, and just dig up. Like I said, I just wanted to get this PSA because I'm getting a little collection started him. He's in the Hockey Hall of Fame. You know, speaking of Hall of Famers, I got um, TTM, Ryan Sandberg. I sent him like 10 bucks or 20 bucks, whatever. Finally got these two signed. And also... I got this PSA DNA of Hall of Fame quarterback, um, Bob Greasy. 
Also, I got um, not a Hall of Fame, but a good ball player. Played in the NBA for a while. He don't get too many NBA um, autographs. And just when it came back from Arizona, I thought it was spring training. But I guess y'all can figure out to see if y'all do any basketball. TTM, this is Mike Bibby. He's a real good TTM, real sign, whatever you got. And these, I'm really digging these. So definitely hit up Mike Bibby. His address is on Sports Card Forum. All right, so that's for Mike Bibby. Next one, another Hall of Famer. You got Dan Hampton signed the Rackers card, and he signed this. So appreciate him signing. And also, the same guy that I got in person in Georgia Tech also found some certified autographs. So I was picking him up just for kicks and giggles. Trey Beckham. Another Hall of Famer here, Lenny Moore. He signed two. I got Wrestling Hall of Famer Terry Funk. He signed three, I think. All right, let's see what this is here. All right. Let's move some stuff to the side here. Next one, not a Hall of Famer, but, you know, get this for this little Colts project I'm working on. I got quarterback Greg Landry signed, too. Just trying to look some other stuff here. here. Then I got Bucky Dilts. Oh, yeah, and he signed his own card here too. I was trying to match this with that, so he signed this in the index card, so I appreciate him doing that. And now one of these Panini um, college cards like I got from spring training. This is Mark Ahana. He signed one. And also got a baseball player, Don Lee. I got a hockey player who some say he should be in the Hall of Fame. He's not. Don Marshall signed this. He also signed the index card. And signed a couple more. And finally, for my Heisman Trophy project, I ended up getting some more cards um, after the fact. I was going to send them, but I forgot I had these out, so I got these in. This is Billy Sims signed three. Hopefully one of these will show up in the PSA video. But yeah, that was a hell of a mail day. Got a bunch of stuff coming in. Um, I was supposed to go to the game today, but I was able to make it down there today, but I'm definitely, I'm trying to go to Georgia Tech when they play Virginia Tech this weekend as soon as my stuff gets in the mail that I need to get signed. And then as far as basketball, I don't think I'll be going to another basketball game probably until April to do my schedule and be able to see, uh, you know, any more Hawks games. But yeah, I definitely got baseball coming in and hopefully I have a couple more things to trickle out TTM. I got a bunch of stuff I need to send out and just having that time to start writing in. So the stuff may drive for a little bit just because I haven't been sending out. Once I start sending out and more stuff will come back in. So definitely stay tuned. But other than that, gotta run, put everything up, and do a couple things here. I'm just your boy, Mr. Veggie Man, aka Tail Car Collector, aka the Cucumber Creeper, aka the Man Bolt of the Made Mamas, aka the Stripper Man, also known as the Autograph Whore. Like, comment, subscribe, be blessed, stay safe, stay successful. Not in.